how does it feel like to be a part of ICAP 2016 once again? It was a great pleasure to be back at ICAP. This is the second consecutive year I've been here and I hope to come again next year because I think it's an excellent conference uh, bringing together people not just from all of South Asia but also from Australia and from Europe. So it's a great event to be a part of. So also, what are the areas in psychology that you think needs improvement in Sri Lanka? Well, I think you heard from uh, Professor Ho's keynote address about the importance of positive psychology approaches. But I think, uh, as he also said, that needs to be tempered by cultural sensitivity. So it's pointless actually applying Western models to different cultures. I think these models need to be adapted uh, to the culture in which they're actually delivered. But I think it's very important. Uh, for example, one of the things that we've focused on too much is post-traumatic stress and we've actually forgotten that for a lot of people, traumatic events can lead to post-traumatic growth. Now, that's not to say people are really caused considerable hardship and impairment by trauma, but for a number of people, it turns their life around. They suddenly just come to a decision, my gosh, I'm alive, I'd better make the best of my life. So it's not always bad. We need to also help people who are distressed, but also encourage people to grow through adversity. Yes, also, do you have a message for all the psychology enthusiasts? Well, I think that the attendance, the energy in the audience, the presentations actually show how much enthusiasm uh, there is here. And when I was here last year, I went to India right away after uh, being at the conference here. But I'm absolutely delighted to be back because uh, there's lots of very positive, very energetic work happening here. And it's nice to see that Sri Lanka is leading a lot of the work in South Asia. Thank you, sir. Pleasure.